How's it going, YouTube? This is Wake Run Collapse, and let the games begin. I'm a classy mofo, so I'm using a regular glass to fill my amaretto, because I'm drinking amaretto tonight, and this is how I'm going to be shooting box 14 of Tidal Storm and box 14 of Gaia Volcano. It is not my first glass of amaretto, which tastes like cherry and almonds to liqueur. It's not terribly strong, but... It's certainly no wine. It's about half the strength of something like a tequila or vodka or whiskey. And I had one of these glasses about this size about, I don't know, 20 minutes ago or so. I'm home from work. I don't need to, um, don't need to go anywhere, so I'm going to stay in and drink for every EX that I get. And this is how this is going to go. So I'm going to do Tidal Storm and Gaia Volcano. Get into this. We have Escape Rope, Badoof, Phoebus, Beedrill, and nice a holographic swampert. I just used that as a thumbnail for a video. So, uh, by the way, Merry Christmas, I guess. Yeah, Merry Christmas, I guess. Because I'm shooting this on Christmas Eve. I've not wrapped any presents yet, but that will assuredly come afterwards. I'm shooting this now, then I'm going to go get some dinner and then start wrapping. We have Lantern, Tentacool, Clam Pearl, Kakuna, and Walrein. Still have most of my headway to make in my Tidal Storm set, so I'm hoping to get something new out of this box. Gardevoir Spirit Link, Barboach, Tynamo, Celio, and oh nice, it's a Mega Gardevoir EX. It is impossible to argue with an awesome pull like this, except for the fact that it's not a Primal Kyogre, but I can certainly stand to look at this Gardevoir a little bit more, so that means it's time for a drink. Yum. Bottoms up, guys. Mmm. Yummy. I've recently switched to Amaretto. Um, I think the regular is about 20% alcohol by volume, so... De is a little bit more, but it's also a lot more expensive, so I would rather just buy the cheap stuff that I know tastes good. Oh, Hollow Electros. This is in no way condoning the uh, the idea of underage drinking, because I do not condone underage drinking, even though I know it goes on and happens and such. So, I invite you, if you are playing along, following along at home, if you are under the age of 21 or under the legal age, whatever the legal age happens to be, wherever it is you live, to follow along with a legal beverage of choice, like water or apple juice or Mountain Dew, whatever it is you guys drink these days. Some weird green juice stuff. I don't know. Honestly, I just drink water and alcohol. <laughs> That's really the only things that I drink. Uh, yes, Azumarill, Corfish, and these other guys. I feel like as I take more drinks out of what is, again, as I mentioned before, not my first drink since I sat down here, it might deteriorate, so rather than potentially slur my words, I am going to just bow out of the whole reading of the names of cards, and it's a Gardevoir EX. Excellent companion piece to some other random card that I pulled earlier. And I feel like I don't have too many regular Gardevoirs, so very happy to see that. Time for a drink. Oh. Very good. I think my next sip needs to be larger. When I drink Amaretto, I tend to just sip at it, but I tend to sip fairly frequently, which I suppose does the trick. Because I turn drinking into an Olympic sport most of the time. I don't drink casually. I drink to get to the uh, the point that I want to be at. And then I just kind of maintain from there. So, Oh, nice. Another holographic Kingdra. Excellent stuff. So, um, I hope you guys are having a good holiday season. Whatever it is that you happen to celebrate, you know. Could be Christmas, could be Hanukkah, could be Kwanzaa. You may not celebrate at all. And if you don't celebrate at all, I hope you are just having a great time. 
Uh, Kyogre Spirit Link, Skitty, Celio, Kakuna, and Ludicolo. I feel like my pull ratios have actually been pretty good in this box so far. So I'm expecting a, uh, a correction in a few packs. Uh, this one gives us a Whiskash, Babaro, Phoebus, Electro, uh, Electric, sorry, and Archie's um, Trump card, which I still need the full art for. That would be pretty awesome. If I get the Archie and the Dive Ball, that would mostly be what I'm looking for, because most of the ones that I'm still missing aside from those are probably not going to be terribly expensive. There's the Azumarill. Because what, I'm, what else am I missing from this set? I'm missing... A full art torpedo, which is going to be not much. I'm going to be missing the full art whale lord for my whale party, which is also not too expensive on eBay, and the Gardevoir, which is not as expensive as I thought it would be. Uh, wall rain. Hold on. Well, looks like I have to drink. Sorry, guys, for the spoilers. Uh, Surskit, Spinda, Weedle, and Kyogre EX. Sorry that I fumbled the cards a little bit. The um, the way that I hold the cards now as I pause to drink. Tasty. The way I hold the cards now um, is a little bit awkward, but also allows them to focus a little more easily. Which I suppose is nice. We have a Gorbis. Oh, lack of focus. Come in. Much better. Uh, Corfish, Bidoof, Marsh Tomp, and Professor Birch's Observations. And a quarter. It clearly fell off my desk. Next pack, as we remove the scrap code, we have the regular Swampert. Come on, stop picking up that box over there. Uh, Lotad and these other guys. I've had to pull out my um, X and Y box, my deck box, because the two boxes on the right hand side, as you can see, from the Super Legend set and from X and Y5, are full of duplicates. That's right, they're full. Uh, here we have a Dive Ball, Tynamo, Cedra, Meryl, and Gorbis. Thinking there's probably not going to be anything else in this box, as far as EXs or better are concerned. Uh, three EXs has kind of been the rule in this set, whereas Rising Fist was more like three or four. Uh, this has been more commonly three. Here's a Ludicolo. Awesome sauce. I am just honestly really excited to have a day off tomorrow. Like, it's great that it's Christmas. That's really cool. I'll be able to see some family. But mostly, I'm just looking forward to the day off at work. I worked the seven days before, and I'm working the seven days after it. So if we can just relax a little bit, that'd be nice. Uh, two packs to go. Kind of sad that I view Christmas this way this year, but most of the time I don't really feel this way. It's just being a sandwich between two seven-day weeks is kind of tough. Starmie, Mudkip, Lombre, Bidoof, and the Holographic Huntail. That's probably going to seal the deal on this box. Which, again, is not that big a deal. I'm sure you guys are rooting for four EX boxes because you want me to drink more, but... Final pack is going to give us another Gardevoir Spirit Link, a Phoebus, a Beedrill, a Tentacool, and the regular Kingdra. So, no full arts, no ultra rares in this booster box, but not a big deal. Still got some cool stuff. I actually pulled all three Ancient Trait Holographic cards, I believe. Holographic cards are Electros, Manaphy, Huntail, Ludicolo, Swampert, uh, Kingdra, and Azumarill. Also got the Kyogre EX, Gardevoir EX, and the Mega Gardevoir EX. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Drop down to the comment section below and let me know what you think. Without spoiling the big polls, of course. And immediately following this video, I'm going to be shooting Box 14 of Gaia Volcano. So I might have a little bit of a buzz going on, but really, isn't that the point of all this? I'll see you guys later.